Well, hello everybody and the warmest possible welcome to you as you join our coverage of a game so eagerly awaited by the citizens of the Italian capital and beyond. It's Lazio against Roma, Bianco Celesti against Giallo Rossi, and it has to be said, the level of animosity shown by each set of fans towards the others is really quite something. Everyone here has gone to extraordinary lengths to show their true colours. Everything you see is highly charged. It is pretty much how so many past encounters have been. The history of grudges, scores settled, and the significant number of crazy moments all add up to the occasion we have now. You can tell this is one game, no matter what the state the two clubs are in, which is played at the highest level of intensity. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Well, they call this a friendly, but the crowd clearly doesn't think so. And more, in actual fact, the way. Well, I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really say anything negative about this. And if it is full on then I'll be happy to watch that so it's down to business here who do you think this turns on Jim well I think if we're hoping for something special then it could come from Pedro uh, he may not offer much in the way of finesse but he's very efficient a good decision maker and a strong member of this lineup, so look out for him. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Keeper has beaten it away. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing but instead he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here and here he's had a go And here's Pedro. Oh, that's nice. And he has been fouled there. And he's managed to beat absolutely everyone. Now it's Pedro, can't get the better of his opposite number. And now they can launch a counter. Abraham finds himself offside. And he has a goal! That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And here's Immobile. Gorgeous control there. Now it's Felipe Anderson. Usai goes for the cross. Abraham, and the through ball is intercepted. Good idea, just poorly executed. Oh, that's a foul, free kick's been given. Immobile, he 
hits it! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. The defence did very well to be able to close him down in numbers like that. They basically suffocated his hopes. Get down by a lack... Immobile! And that's it. That was always inevitable. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering and, listen, we all expect that. Lazio have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And that's been levered clear. And it's been taken short. Gets it back. And it's played forward. Abraham. Mkhitaryan. Pass needed to be better than that. And he knows it. Lucas. Felipe Anderson looking to run onto it. Oh, that's neat. A chance to play it in. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. Cristante gets his final warning. Well, I think the referee would have told him to raid it in or, or suffer the consequences. Spinazzola going full steam ahead down the left flank. Gets the better of his man. Roma are level. It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a kneel the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Ah, oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and uh, I still haven't moved. And it's Felipe Anderson. Pellegrini battles to win it back. Savic with the foul. Karsdorp tries to get it forward quickly. Mkhitaryan. Karsdorp has come steaming up from the back for this. And that's been won straight back. And it's half-time here. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, we thought this would be close, Peter, and it's, it's proving us right so far. They're well matched, and it, it presents a, a fascinating battle of wits to see who'll emerge on top or, or otherwise. So in they come for the break with nothing to separate them. The score, 1-1. So we're just settling back into this second half. Pellegrini tries to stroke it through. Husai. 
Lucas. And it's Felipe Anderson. Forward it goes. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball. It's Immobile! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. of the desperate variety. Dashing forward at pace. Lucas. Lazzari. Lucas. Husai. Just brushed off the ball there. Now the counter, hit long and direct. Patrick, oh, real danger here. Can he shoot? Oh, shooting chance! Goal, Roma! And the game is well and truly turned on its head. That's no fluke, it's what he was there for. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. Roma are making a change now. Roma go into the lead. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend. But now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Luis Alberto. Luis Alberto switches it towards the other side. And he's going long. Looking for space out wide. Plenty waiting in the middle. Felipe Anderson. It's broken loose. That's what has to be done now. No question about it. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. There two. Abraham. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their... Felipe Anderson! It's off target and by quite a way. Lazio were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. The changes then in quick succession. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Spinazzola, who does have an assist to his name. Abraham. Santon drives it forward. Mkhitaryan, a scorer already in the game. He's put it on the right now. What's on? What an adventurous run from a defender. Up to meet it! It's a goal! And there's the goal they've been looking for. No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. Now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. 
Well, to wait until now to make this change seems a bit baffling. He's expecting the Miraculous to turn this around from here. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. And it's Pedro. Luis Alberto. El Sharawi has given away a free kick. it out of harm's way chance to shoot and the shot it's wide but only just look I'm sure he'll deny it Peter but the keeper didn't have that covered Four extra minutes. Hoist it forward. He's looked long this time. Oh, it's gone in! Mm. Oh, it's terribly unfortunate for them, and maybe we can attribute that to a, to a loss of focus. Well, who saw that coming? It has certainly made things interesting. Well, that's something you don't expect at a match like this, but I guess you have to take whatever way it comes, and, and very gratefully. And the referee brings it to a close. Roma winners after an absolutely outstanding game. Fabulous drama as they dragged it back from behind. Made